Kick is up. And good! Appalachian State knocks off number 14, Coastal Carolina. App State Mountaineers versus Mullets, 7.30 game on a Wednesday. Weekday games are always electric. So we're here doing some interviews. Let's go Nears. Coastal Carolina, big mullet school. Big mullet. Big mullet. What is your guys' stances on mullets as a whole? I've had a mullet before, I rock with it, man. But not no trashy Myrtle Beach mullet. I rock it better than any one of them motherfuckers. Like, they ain't got shit on my mullet, man. Coastal got some pretty good mullets, but look, mullets don't matter about the scoreboard, though. All due respect, but um, you can't grow a mullet in that kind of community. Why is that? Uh, it's trash. I'm currently growing one right now. Okay. You may not tell, but I, I, it's getting there for sure. The mullet's badass, but Coastal's a bunch of fucking pussies. My mullet would be better than fucking Teddy Gallagher's, I'll tell you that right fucking now. <laughs> love, I love the mullet. Mullets are coming back. Coastal, the Thunder Chickens, they, they don't know what a real mullet is. We live in the sticks and then come out. They're like, where'd you get that haircut? No, dude, I've been growing this for four years. So Wednesday, abnormal time for a game day. Walk me through your day. Did you have class this morning? Did you work? When did drinking commence? Me, myself, I went to my classes sober because I'm a responsible student. My roommate, on the other hand, was pissed drunk in a wife beater in our criminal justice class, and that didn't go over too well. Woke up at 1045, finished up my last bit of homework, started drinking about 11, and then now we're here. Wednesday is, like you said, abnormal day, but like when you wake up, it's it's fucking game day, you know? Got to get like the lunch in real quick, and then we just got the pledges to organize everything. I woke up around 10 o'clock this morning, and I uh, basically had coastal on my mind. Oh, I got to get clean, get fed, go to class, get my education in, you know? And then I was like, at the back of my mind, I had game day in my head the whole day. And I was like, I need to get with my boys. Woke up 7 a.m., took a shit, made a cup of coffee, Normal took another morning. shit, <laughs> ate, <laughs> ate breakfast, one more shit after that. Three shits in the morning. Do you Dude, think that's healthy? Those those are absolute rookie numbers. You're wearing the wrong Mountaineer colors right now. I, I'm supporting the Mountaineers, though. All right, all right. I'll give you a pass. I didn't come here with a mullet. We got two parrots here. Can you just explain why they're here? Like... And talk anything about them? Well, they're just here for the game. Dude, if we beat Coastal Carolina tonight, I'm not going to bed. I might be <laughs> drunk until next month if we beat Coastal Carolina tonight. I hope we win because King Street, King Street will go crazy. Is that the... your bar street, King Street? Yeah, so King Street's right up there. When we won in March Madness, that everyone just flooded to King Street and just went crazy. What do you guys think the attendance rate is going to be tomorrow? Wait, this is a game tomorrow? No, the it's, it's a class, bro. Oh, hell no. I won't, you won't see my ass in class. That's you don't sure. even know there was class. <laughs> hell no. I'm going to try to go to class. I hope a lot of them do, but it's not going to be more than 50%. 15%. Sorry, Mom, 15? I'm going to be there because I'm failing. Less than 5%. 5%? Less than 5%. That's low. Yeah. I mean, it's we're not an academic school. I'm going to go on a limb and say 0%. I will be showing up to my 930, and that is it. You're getting up for your 930 class tomorrow? I'm not saying I'm getting up. I will be dragged in a stretcher. I cannot miss this class. I have a 930, and I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not going to that shit. I'd say any class before noon is going to be a solid 25%. I myself have work at 7 a.m., and attendance for that is probably a 0%. A good 25%. If we win, I'm thinking maybe 30%. That's good. We've been hearing like zero and shit. Oh yeah, if it, oh yeah, it's gonna be a zero if we lose. I'm telling you that right now. <laughs> zero. The <laughs> fuck zero. Oh, I would say it would be down at least by fifty percent. I'm not going to class tomorrow. What if you win? Fucking definitely zero. <laughs> what if you lose? Still gonna be. Uh, I mean, maybe ten percent. If you came out here, just you know, did did a little hanging around, left the game by halftime. You better show up to class. But if you're here having the full experience, full game, partying the whole time, there's no point going to class. That's the best answer we've gotten today. Best answer for that. See, I'll, give, I'll give you the real one. They big Coastal fans or they big F State? They're just big football fans. Oh, they just like a good game. This is from the bottom of my heart. I seriously believe that Tom Holland isn't a good Spider-Man. I would be so much better. And you know why? Because I got the mask right here. Spider-Man. You want me to put it on? You want me to put it on? This is 
your audition. We'll, we'll, s- we'll email this to Tom Holland. What do you want me to say? Like, I don't know. Be Spider-Man. Shoot the webs. Turns you off. Yes, sir. He doesn't talk that much. Someone be the Green Goblin. Someone hey, be the Green Goblin. We got the Green Goblin coming uh, in. Ready? Oh, 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 shit. Wait a yeah. minute. Y'all pay me. Never heard. Yeah, you never heard of him? Oh, yeah, it's a stretch, <laughs> but... <laughs> Wait, oh, wait shit. a minute. Red Cup News. We're interviewing Mitch. Mitch, uh, how's how's West Virginia, man? What do you like about West Virginia? At football or in general? In whatever you want. Football, not good. We're two and four. It's been a rough year. A lot of pain. I'm trying to go rob this bank. Let's go rob this bank, bro. Let's go make some so, money. If you guys hypothetically were to rob a bank, what would be your strategy? Just go in Just there, yo. Fuck, I don't guns care. out, bro. Whatever. We got a living Bud Light. Are you like worried that you're gonna get brutally murdered today, like all the other beers? Hell no. Nah. I'm beer guy, you know. I'm the mascot of everything fun about Appalachian State, you know. <laughs> oh, should we get actual hey, what's Avatar? What's up, dude? Aang over here. Just got here from the Air Temple. What was the hardest element to learn how to use? Definitely fire. Fire. fire? I kept getting burned no matter what, but. Why is App State the greatest school on the planet? Look around. Look around. <laughs> Take a look around, man. Down to earth people. Girls with nose rings, guys with nose rings, nobody gives a shit. You can do whatever you want. I would honestly say all these guys behind me. Yeah. And all I gotta say is nearest by 90. The bitches. Your bitches are your favorite part. Describe Honest. App State in one word, and it can't be bitches. Um indescribable, honestly. My favorite part of App State, uh, the air temple we got up on Howard Knob. It's immaculate. What's your favorite part about the Air Temple? Uh, the bitches. Favorite part about App State? Definitely the people. Everyone's laid back and chill. Feel like this is a great community. The uh, intramural football. Intramural football? How, how's your team this year? So, we're in the Sweet 16 of the playoffs right now. We play Pike tomorrow. And then... Is that a big matchup? Uh, we already beat them by like 40. Uh, probably the mountains. Definitely the mountains. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, I gotta be that basic bitch. The mountains and the comedy here, man. Everyone get together. It's, it's pretty. Nice. D- First time here, it's pretty. My favorite part about App State is probably the football because all the fans are very energetic. <laughs> the girls. Honestly, I just like being to go outside in my underwear and being able to pee on the front porch and say this is God's country. I'm gonna say the three B's. Beer bras, and boobs. People think it's a small school, but I mean, we have like over 20,000 kids. 20K, I checked, I Googled it this morning, exactly. 20K. So I mean, as as little as people think it is, we're still a big school and we represent a lot, you know. A lot of people try to give us shit for being, you know, too rowdy and all that, but that's just the point of being sports fans. You know, we, we talk some shit, you know, we, we have our tailgates, we make some noise in the stadium. You know, that's just how it's supposed to be. If you're thinking about coming to App State, bring your ass, because we're lit. And definitely, you need to be the fuck here on the mountain and in Boone and having fun. Because if you're not, you're missing out. If you don't know what you're so. doing, App State's the place to find out what you're doing. You on TV right now, bro? Hopefully. I feel like we take our studies uh, to the roof here. I think, I think we'll... We gotta play beer die. Yeah, yeah, true. All right, shout out Culeen. So, Appa, where did you park him? I know parking on game day, so, usually difficult. I usually, uh, Campus West, back over there, uh, my parking complex. They accommodate Appas? Yeah, he's got like a little shed, a little, uh, barn. Undergrad right. here, graduate school, oh. West Virginia. So, so that's a we got Mountaineer a, Square. We got a Mountaineer <laughs> Square. Oh, 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 I got a Monte Simpre Libra right here. Oh. So you're not an App State student. A- Averett Coug- Aver Cougars? I go, I, go to, I go to Averett. That's where you are. I go to Averett, no way, bro. Yeah, I think there's like looking at Wells Fargo up here. You might have to like. Right, there's a few Wells Fargo, actually. 15 seconds. What do you want to tell the people? Say a plug, talk about anything you want. The only thing I got to say, as I've been watching Red Cup News, is Rush Fidel. Yes, sir! Hey, shorties, get at me. Girls, get at me. Shut your bitch ass up, all y'all niggas. Girls, get at me. Bro, beers, drink beers. I'm glad we're out here. These guys do amazing content. Hey, man, I went to Wyoming. This man saved my life in Wyoming, man. This kid's a fucking legend right here, bro. To the people of Red Cup News, go Nears, and fuck Coastal. We don't play overrated and underrated teams like Coastal, having their 6-0 record playing Handicap teams. What do you want to say to the people? Hey, roll nears. Horns down. 15 seconds, say plug, talk about anything you guys want. What do you want to tell the people? I just want to say shout out Red Cup News. 
the biggest game in Instagram, they're, they're on the rise. Just, if, you, if you don't follow them yet, then you lack and Go ahead and follow them. Red Cup News. Might yak in the next hour, but that depends on how much free food I can get. So uh, stay tuned for the weekly update. Well, they, they, they claim that's a, a beach chicken, but I call them bitch chickens. Oh, yeah. I would just like to say that I hope everyone knows that they're beautiful and loved and everyone stays positive and knows that you're amazing. <laughs> All right, this is from Appalachian State, Red News, baby. We're signing out. Rush signal.